फेस्टिवल ऑफ शिवा शिवरात्रि इज सेलिब्रेटेड एमोंग द हिंदूज एंड फॉर मेनी पीपल अराउंड द वर्ल्ड एंड दे आर फॉरगोटन दैट द फेस्टिवल इज दे लैंड अप विथ हरिकथे जस्ट द स्टोरी एंड द फिनिश टर्म द रियल फेस्टिवल इज द थांडवर डांस द डांस ऑफ द Shiva. I am not going deep into the philosophy of the dance because it is there in almost all the books. Tandava, also known as Tandava Natyam, is a divine dance performed by the Hindu god Shiva. Shiva is depicted as dancing the Tandava in his form of Nataraj, the Natya Shastra. A Sanskrit treatise on the performing arts describes various aspects of the Tandava: Ananda Tandava, Tripura Tandava, Sandhya Tandava, Samhara Tandava, Kali Tandava, Uma Tandava, Shiva Tandava, Krishna Tandava, and Gauri Tandava. Varieties. It all depends upon the mood and the circumstances. The dance. The Tandava dance originated from time immemorial, from the human time, or from the where the life originated. But then it has been connected to our Hindu god, the Shiva. But all those people who believes and worship Shiva, they have to understand that every every one aspect. including the cooking we say the recipe is sung before the cook and before the recipe is sung they dance and play with the pot recently i seen some street violas throwing and throwing the uh, tea cup up and down and down they enjoy that is called gili gili tea gili gili food gili gili means whatever you do you do it with love and the tandava dance is practiced only in one place in the whole world and everybody was shocked when i was in japan the japanese boys are scared of only one team one group japanese boys the modern boys knows quite a lot of dance and girls so but when you go to the disco centers they were shocked the nigerians the ghanians the africans wow they when they start the dance tandava is the real dance they practice and they can dance hours together they say and they keep doing so much if there was not an orgasmic of there was not an ejaculation these people are going to forget to stop making love such was the dance and the whole world was watching and the world or neither india could interfere and tell them this was our shiva's dandava dance really practiced when nelson mandela was inside the jail release nelson mandela campaign was going on and throughout the streets and almost all the televisions around the world were showing only one thing the south african people were dancing in the street for every one thing every one protest they only dance they never walk they never walk the day you walk finish your death started when i was practicing martial arts i was taught that no walking allowed only run and i was thinking why run and when i started the school rakum school i never walked to take anything when we didn't have food we asked for excess food when we didn't have 
Clothes, we asked for old clothes and people used to bring a lot of old clothes and newspapers and I used to run and take it and run inside holding it right into my heart. Because I believe that's one way I get my exercise and seeing my running, the whole world came and gave us, the whole world came and gave us, yes. The dance is very important. They dance and dance and dance. Yes. That dance, which we have seen last year when uh, um, Varun, the INTUC state president for the youth, he brought a team to have pili dance, that is pulley dance, that is tiger dance. Wow, that was powerful, energetic, lifting the leg up and stamping it on the floor. That shakes the whole body. You don't need any Viagra tablets for performing. You don't need any high energy drinks, Monster Red Bull to perform. Any kind of activity that inside the dance, inside the Dandava dance, all the medicines are involved. No disease ever dare come near you because your power is so much. Yes, every one thing when you do, you have seen in many of the Indian villages, especially in Karnataka, in the villages, when they go for farming, when they go to plant the ragi or rice, water paddy or whatever it is, they sing a song and they dance before they plant it and the ending also the dance, make sure they dance in our Indian culture. Girls are compulsorily taught to dance and sing. So when, the, when they're going to get married, the boys People ask the girl, do you know to sing and dance? If she doesn't know, they might not accept that fast. Singing and dancing. But we forgot to teach our men and our men became so pale and tired and stiff. The yin and the yang never worked together. Dance, the underwear dance. Don't forget before and after any function. I think kurgis are doing a little bit. But the Dandava dance should be every day, not once in Shivaratri. It can be Ananda Tandava, it can be Tripura Tandava, Sandhya Tandava, Samara Tandava, Kali Tandava, Uma Tandava, or Shiva's aggressive Tandava, Krishna Tandava, Gauri, call it by any. But dance, yes. Animals also dance, birds dance, the rain dances, yes. The wind dances or make the trees to dance and it should be thunder, powerful, aggressive to your mood. And you can see every part of your body is moving. You don't have to go to any gym. Practice Tandava. That is our Sanskriti. And once you practice Tandava, you find the third eye is opening. Shiva's eye. When is you are meditative deep inside your talent is opening to a vast beautiful world of creativity and in that creativity you find truth and enlightenment it is filled of diamonds and gold and powerful money you don't have to call and tell people i am poor you have to only tell you don't even have to tell people look at you they never call you poor they call you pure you don't have to win dress up without dress also your body looks so pure powerful when you are having a dhant of a dance it is much much higher than the gymnasium much much higher than the martial arts in the dance classes you go every day every moment dance and sing that is the way of life which is close to god the thunderbird